All right, Matt. Yeah? I know what you're thinking. What am I thinking? You're thinking, Jeff, would you shut the fuck up about Immortals Phoenix Rising already? No, because and I like this game, too. <laughs> and the answer is no, I will not shut up about Immortals Phoenix Rising already. Uh, the second DLC for Immortals Phoenix Rising came out last month, and I totally missed it. And uh, yeah, we're gonna look at it today. I, so I, I mean, it's like it's like Asian inspired. Mm -hmm. That's very fucking cool. Yep. Uh, so welcome back, everybody, to the JoJo. We're on Rage Light Time, Jeff. I'm Matt. Um, uh, yeah, this one's based on Chinese mythology, oh. and it's like a total. It's kind of a semi-total conversion. Um, like it's a new map, but very much the same gameplay mechanics. Gotcha. Uh, Okay, but so it's it's almost like a sequel, not a sequel, but just like a different. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's DLC, um, and actually, the third DLC comes out this week, and we'll probably look at it at some point next week. But yeah, um, yeah uh, I didn't realize that this had happened. I actually watched a review for this uh -huh. uh, where they were like, um, uh, "It's just it's not that dissimilar to the the main game," and yeah. I'm like, "Okay, cool, guys. Uh, I'm cool with that, guys." <laughs> Man, the gods really love turning people into stone. Don't they, though? Like, uh, okay, I'm actually, like, super interested in this now because, I, I'll be honest, I don't know a whole lot about Chinese mythology. Mm -hmm. I mean, I fucking, I fucks with Japanese mythology, but that's because they use it in everything. But um, I, when it comes to Chinese mythology, you know, I'm just... Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, so it is a Chinese developed. All right, yeah. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I like that one mountain is shaped like a giant gourd. Which one? The one to the oh, left. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I was uh, thinking cute. I was thinking nipple personally, but Oh uh, well. Yeah. All right. Uh, Myths of the Eastern Realm. And actually knowing that this came out inspired me to go back and finish the whole uh, a new god uh, like trial. I got to play that uh, DLC. It was pretty fun. I mean, it was just puzzles, but the I the, sky. the mountain's fractured as well. Oh, I bet you're going to meet Sun Wukong at some point. God, I really hope you do. I really hope that they just spent some... I mean, like, it already seems like they've got better animation here than they did in the main game. My mm. biggest problem with yeah. Immortals is that they use these, like, super stock animations mm -hmm. in the cutscenes, and they suck. <laughs> they suck so bad. This game could be, like, like Game of the Year 20... Uh, 2020 mm -hmm. if it had had just like a little bit more polish but it was obvious they were just like ah oh, we gotta fucking gotta cool, like get something out you gotta get <laughs> gotta get gotta get, get a game out. out get it out because there's 500 like other things coming out okay so instead of pomegranates we got peaches oh well that tracks <laughs> okay uh david might double jump okay got my double jump but even meaner than before oh i earned a reward uh okay so Get some of this. Yeah, get some of that. Some of these. One of these. One of those. One of these. Aha! Sure, I do. Ah. Oh, whoa. Oh, shit. Nice. That's right. I know how I played a Dark Soul once. I played Breath of the Wild. Jesus. Come on, dude. Hey. Do I have my powers? What powers? Oh, I have that one. Well, that's all right. Do I have the uh, whoa, uppercut? Whoa. Let's yeah, see. Yeah, I have that one. Do a little yeah, boy. air juggling. I did. Whoa! I I, I really just ah. Uh, nice. I got to go back and play this. I remember just being really frustrated because because I went and I lit all those pyres. Uh huh. And oh. And uh, I lit all those pyres in the main game, and then I realized, oh, that's a different quest chain I haven't unlocked yet. And I got real frustrated about that. Idiot. Uh, did you call me an idiot? No, 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 no. I called that guy an idiot because I threw a rock at him and All he right. just stood there and took it. Sitting here burying my soul, and you're like, oh, well, Matt, you are a piece of shit. Um, dodge, parry, spin, thrust. Um, I'm so used to being, like, so redonkulously overpowered. Yeah, now uh, you're like, ugh. It's like, where are all my fucking powers, man? Um, Damn. Okay, so you feel Ku's health. I don't need to refill my health. I'm I'm too good. I don't need that. Yeah. Uh, so where am I going? Thirty one, thirty. Going over. over I am I am a hundred percent in favor of. Uh, where am I going? Oh, okay. There going. being more. Uh, there being more like, like media based around Chinese history and mythology. Mm -hmm. Because one thing that. Uh, I, I I remember I think Accent at Cinema talked about this. 
uh, about how one of the problems that a lot of Chinese media has had, especially in the last 10 or so years, is they keep trying to do stuff like other people, other countries. They, they keep, keep trying to make, like, <laughs> Avengers, but the Chinese Avengers. Yeah, uh, or, they, or they keep trying to make, uh, or, or their action movies, they keep trying to make them like American action movies. Right. And, um... I mean, I don't... The only thing I know is, isn't the whole, like, Monkey Monkey King, that's, uh... Yeah, that's Sun Wukong. Uh, yeah, that's, like, the only thing that I know because... Because well, of Journey, Journey to the West. East, Journey to the West, uh -huh. where, like... But, like, that comes up all the time. Like, I feel like it's, like, there's just a million properties that are based off of that. Well, I'll tell um, you why it's like that. Why there's a million properties based on that, like Dragon Ball and stuff like that. Yeah. It's because Journey to the West is... It's... God damn it. It's okay. fucking, um, well, Dragon Ball is Momotaro plus some, uh, Journey to the West. Uh -huh. But uh, Sun Wukong is like the equivalent of somebody like Hercules or Jesus. Uh -huh. Like it's a, it is a cornerstone. Like it is the, it is like Luke Skywalker, hero of, of a thousand faces, cornerstone of Asian mythology. Dude, I want to see Jesus flying around on like a, a cloud. Like, oh, uh, dude. Tricking. Jesus and Sun Wukong teaming up. <laughs> and he's like, he's like flying around with him on a, and he's like, I didn't get a cloud. And Sun Wukong God is like, it. yeah, I know it's dope, right? And, <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. Oh, okay. You're just going off the side of cliffs. That is a that is a pretty good joke in the uh, Dragon Ball abridged parody series. Um, one guy one guy says, "So you're Son Wukong, right?" Oh shit! He's like, "I'm Son Goku, yes." Just roll with it. <laughs> Does he turn into a giant monkey? Uh, Son Wukong. The the oh. the the monkey king the oh. actual monkey king does he uh, get like no, that does he is, go kaiju size uh he, i think he can, he can change size uh, okay. i think i think i might be getting it confused with hanuman the uh indian uh, not Indian. Wow, uh, I'm really the glad. Hindu, uh, 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 monkey god. Really glad you're here, Matt. I don't like truck with <laughs> with any any mythology at all. I'm just like Harry Potter. I know Harry Potter. Uh, <laughs> you know a Star Wars. I, I, Superman. You want to talk about? I can talk about Superman for a long time. Well, um, I, I have recently. Oh, whoa, those guys are guys. Those guys are just fun. The, oh, they're they're, they're uh, the Gorgons. Yeah, they're Gorgon uh, uh, character models. Yeah, but they're like they got like oh, bull heads and I, then like snake bodies. Dude, the fuck are these guys? They're like lions and. And, oh, you know what? I bet we're gonna fight some Jiangxi, some of the Chinese vampires, the ones that hop around. Oh, that'd be pretty cool. I, I really want them to show up. There's a. Uh, whoa. Oh, oh God. Whoa, 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 uh, whoa, whoa. I mean, whoa. I, I can climb on stuff. Oh, okay. So it's fine. Oh, that's right. It's Breath of the Wild. Yeah. Um. Uh. It's like. <laughs> it's Breath of the Wild rules. No need to. No need to worry too much. I also just have been. Um. Like just to go back to my old mainstays, like. You know, this may be a Breath of the Wild ripoff, but it's a really good Breath of the Wild ripoff. Like, nice. Um, yeah, like it looks really good and it plays really solidly. And you know, there's like a million little things to pick up and you can make yourself some some uh, some potions. And what do we got in here? Yeah. No, I I, I mean that's a, that was. I wonder if it has the humor, because uh, that was mm. one of the things that really struck me about. Immortals was just how it was really. I thought it was really funny. Yeah, uh, it, it, I agree. Um, I don't know if this is made with a slightly more Chinese audience in mind. It may not have the same style of humor. Yeah, because it, because uh, the the Greek Immortals yes, Phoenix Rising was a lot more. Um, I recognize that song. was a lot more uh, sarcastic. Guys. Yeah, and sarcasm's not really an oh. Asian humor style. I got my bow. We talked about that many times. Oh. Uh, Oh, is this? Oh, there you go. Saffron? Wait, what do I do in here? Hmm. Oh, I, I already have that? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Dope. Oh. Oh. In More. Interesting. Okay. I'm going to let you figure this out. Oh, man. Almost. Okay. Hmm. I think I'm going backwards. Uh oh. Uh, uh kind of just going at random right now. Uh, oh okay. yeah, shit. Okay. Alright. That's all three. Mm. That one's all three. Hmm. These are i no I'm I'm not very good at these. Uh I just I usually just hit my head against them until they stop being yeah, that. That's kind of what I'm doing right now. Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean I mean if you want to just come back to this later or something or Oh, well, hold on. Alright. 
Yeah, I, I did discover a new. Um, I discovered a new YouTube channel. Well, it's not new. It's been around for a while, but I fucking love it. It's called um, Overly Sarcastic Productions. Uh huh. And she does these cute little cartoon versions of mythology stuff. Okay. And um, it's very well done. Uh, she is clearly like a student of mythology. Like she makes references to specific translations and specific like papers uh -huh. and stuff. And uh, uh, and she just got extra points with me because she uh, she did a kaiju video. Oh. And her kaiju video fucking gets it. Like, well, she fucking go. gets it. And I'm like, thank you. Jeff, go do something else. No, I got to figure it out, <laughs> oh, Matt. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, one of these. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I can get these. I'm, I'm almost there. Like, I can, I can get here's all but one. Uh, let's see. Can I just like sh sh regular shoot? Oh wait, okay. I don't really need to do that. Uh, can you do this one? Uh, okay, so it's whatever it's touching. Okay, I feel yeah, I feel like you're almost there, but it keeps not doing that. When's my Okami sequel coming out? <laughs> <laughs> like they said, where they were gonna do it. Oh, well, that's not right. Wait, hold on. If I do this one. <coughs> And then this one, come on, go, recharge. Jeff, what? We're doing a show. I know. <laughs> Jesus. I'm doing what I've, uh, uh, all right. I came here to oh, solve oh, puzzles. Oh, oh, oh. And chew bubble gum. Mm, mm, Wait, mm, 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 that's mm. not going to work. No. Oh, mm. I feel like almost. Ah. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, very close. Uh, mm -hmm. Still not uh -huh. there. And then I got this one. Oh my God. I, the goddess is like, where have you been? The All right, goddess fine. is like, la, 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 la. <laughs> I want the upgrades. I want the I, upgrades. I know, I know you want the upgrades, but uh, we're, we're doing a show. Uh -huh. Okay, that does the center. Okay. Oh, my God. Uh -huh. Yeah, I've run into puzzles like this in the game, and I'm just like, I'm bashing my head against it. And this is going to do everything but the it's middle. Gonna, it's going to mess up the middle. Yep. Uh, Balls. Yep. Uh -huh. Wait, hold on. If okay. we do this... Uh-huh. No. Because then it's going to do that. Yeah, then that's going to turn that one. Yep. And then if we go... Damn it. You know, in the back where we started. In Immortals, um, in Immortals, I was... Uh, it, they had the, the slidey block puzzles. Yeah. Um... You know, the, like, uh, put the numbers in order puzzles, basically. Yeah, yeah. And I'm, like, really good at those. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Um, okay, wait. Okay, okay, okay. What? I think, we can, I think we can do it. What? Maybe now. Hold on. Actually, I think I know. Uh-huh. Uh oh, no, that's not going to work, is it? Jeff! <laughs> Wait, hold on. No! And, and now everything oh, but the middle is done. Okay. Yay! We almost did it! We almost oh. did it! All right, I need God. my arrows to recharge. All right, okay. let's, let's go continue the actual fucking okay, story. Okay, thank you. But I'm going to come back and do that in a minute. Okay, good. Uh, well, now we have another ooh. puzzle. All right. Thank God for that. No, we just got to go upstairs. All right. Uh, do, 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 do. He, doesn't have the, he doesn't have the little, like, uh, fan on, on his back like yeah, uh, I, Phoenix mm, does. Oh, oh, here we go. Here. Hi. Did you design this character? No. Oh. Uh, it's just like default. Oh, okay. Default character. I don't know if you could do any customization. Um, hi. Oh, she's got the same constellations, like the yeah. Greek gods. She's, uh, she's pretty cool. Uh, she's got a headache? Apparently. you got a gods she's with sad. headaches. Oh, 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 right. Tall. Hi. Oh, so the internet must really like her. They want yeah. her to step on them. <laughs> They, what, how tall is she, and feel, what's her shoe size? There was a there was a there was a thing on the internet where like somebody made a video what that was like, time? you don't actually want that lady okay? from Resident Evil to step how on you, and the internet was what fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, don't tell the internet what it can and can't be horny for. Yeah. The destruction of the sky pillar. The sky pillar. Bujo Mountain created the scar tarnishing our sky. You got a sky anus. Mm, a sky no, anus no. problem. Energy was too much to bear for God and human alike. Uh, mm. Everyone? 
We have to do something. This is we shit. This is we shit, mortal. <laughs> I promise, child, I can undo all of the damage. All it requires is for the balance to be restored. Ah, just like Anakin Skywalker. Uh, Where are the younglings? Point yeah. me in the direction yeah, of the I younglings. Can, I'll fix. I'll fix them. I'll balance the force. <laughs> I'll balance the fuck out of it. Oh man, you're bad at younglings. <laughs> Dangers roam the land. Cool. I must return to the forge and continue my work. Cool. You will be safe inside here. Not cool. If I'm going outside. Uh, wait, no. Wait, are you? What are you doing? Are you locking me in the fucking basement? Just because I'm a mortal, a, a mortal. <sighs> yeah. Well, uh, do we have that armor? The thing in our arm? I think so. I don't know. Huh. I haven't been paying as much attention. Hmm. Oh, maybe oh, well, not. No, apparently not. What's this? It's the like. It's like your speed pass, right? Uh, oh, can't we? Okay. Again. I haven't woken up with a headache in a strange place in years. <sighs> Youth. Did you no. see? Oh. Where am I? Did you see? A gateway to heaven. Ruins of heaven may heaven hold valuable heaven. rewards that can be accessed by entering gateways. Okay. Oh, like the like the challenge areas. You're right. Uh, oh. oh my oh, god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like going into like the sun. Jesus. All okay. Right. Mm, good. Hot, hot, hot. Yeah. Okay. All right. Expanse of the king amongst the clouds. The heavenly kingdom is but a crypt for the gods. Now. Hop on Whoa. a cloud to reach your destination. Oh, there you go. If the cloud bumps into a solid object, that will dissipate into thin air. So be careful. Apparently, my feet don't count as a solid uh, object. Apparently, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh I see. Ooh. Huh. Ooh. Ha. I like the way you can mantle on a cloud. That's yeah, cool. right. <laughs> um, so what were you? What were you asking? What did I see? Uh, uh mm, hold on. I'm trying to remember now. Oh, uh, there was an animated movie. It came out. Um, there are two kind of Chinese-centric animated movies uh -huh. that uh, oh, Morgan, whoa, Morgan and I watched, like, in the thick of quarantine. Uh -huh. One was, I think, The White Snake or The White Serpent or something. Okay. And it was sort of like trying to be frozen, but more giant snakes. And um, then there was... What am I doing with this? Am uh, I going to that no, other cloud? It's got spikies on it, though. Am I going to this over here? I guess, yeah. And I guess, like, over here? Yes. I can see what this is. There's a dragon. Okay. Oh, was that a good thing? Okay, uh, I guess cool. I got, a, I got another cloud so I can get up there. Okay. All right. Little I do little puffy clouds. Yeah, Those that's are pretty fun. cool. Yeah, uh, the white snake and the other one was uh, over the moon, which is that one that was like had the uh, I think Glenn Keen was or somebody from Disney was in charge of it. That was the one where the little girl goes to the moon. Yeah, she makes her own rocket, goes to the moon, meets yeah. the the goddess of the moon. I did not care for that movie. Oh, I thought it was cute. Uh, it, it it was like I don't know. Um, I'll be honest, like. I didn't have any problem with the Jeez, mythologies and all that stuff, but I the whole, like, I like built my own moon rocket out of, like, <laughs> that was what did a, it for a you? car and an electro train, and I'm just like, nah, dude. Nah, you would die. <laughs> You'd be dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, cool. Oh, blades of Huangdi and axe of Yan. Yeah, so my L1, like, the things come up from the ground, so it's like, I got Whoa. that. Um, cool. Okay. And then I got the big uh, that one. Some of this, and so. one of these, and one of those. Um. Oh man, um, there was a movie, like a lost movie from China, mm -hmm. called I think it was called The War God versus the Martians. Nice. Yeah. Um, and it was, uh, yeah, it was, it was this. Oh, Jesus. I think it's kind of a lost movie. I think some of the people found it though, but yeah, it's about a giant war god in modern day China or in like 1960s China, and he fights aliens. Nice. And it's, so it's kind of like Ultraman. Um, I saw a short film remake of it, like a parody version that wasn't allowed to be shown in China because it's like super critical of the government. 
<laughs> oh, right. Yeah, it was really funny. Like, these, these reporters are going around being like, uh, being like, well, there's a lot of rumors going around that there are giant aliens fighting a war god in the middle of, uh, of downtown Shanghai or whatever. Uh, this is all uh, propaganda by, uh, by American capitalists. And... Uh, Cool. They really, yeah, they really leaned into it. God's meter builds up the Kusio meter by landing. Oh, okay, interesting. So it's like they formalized the, um, uh, they formalized the uh, uh, combo system from oh. Phoenix. Okay. Because like as you get further and further along in Phoenix, like the more uninterrupted hits you do, like the harder you hit. And so it's mm. got that kind of like, kind of that Arkham uh, combo right. incentive. <laughs> yeah. Of dead fools. Um. To incentivize you to like the don't get hit. Mm. Who is this dark presence? Do we know who this dark presence is? No, it's um. Can I have my another okay. cloud, please? I think is there is maybe got to hit the button again. What are you? Wait, what's? Uh, was there a button? Button, button. Who's got the button? Go, go around. Turn, 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 turn. Oh, I thought there was a button. Oh, wait, oh, it's coming over here. Okay. Oh, it comes through here and then goes. Okay. All right, that makes sense. And then it's the great isn't a solid object either. The wind blows. Woot. Yeah, it does. Bam. Um, whoa. And then, ha ha. Oh, and then you're gonna have to. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, it's interesting. Uh, prepping for this by playing a new god means that like that entire DLC was just nothing but harder and harder uh, Phoenix puzzles, Ooh, basically. That sounds. Um, uh, oh, interesting. Mm. So this you normally, like in Phoenix, this would, these red areas would uh, were just like no go zones because they drain your stamina. So you can't use like your double jumps or your wings or anything like that. Mm -hmm. Oh shit! Yeah. I, I fucked that one up. Uh, there it okay, goes. now you got another one. Cool. Um, yeah. Yeah, I'm a bit. I'm a. I'm a freaking fan, fan of this franchise. You're a fan. All fan right. of this franchise. Yeah, I um. Another. It's a, it's very interesting how nowadays uh something that used would have in the past have been like a, a sequel, is now just DLC. I think it's interesting. Um, I I think that the thing that interests that's that I find so interesting about these about this set of DLCs specifically is that like oh we got wings. Oh, cool. These might be my way out. Wait, I should be able to, like... I don't think you've activated them. There, oh, there we go. go. Ah, uh, those are fun. Um, like, the way that this has been just repurposed from the main game. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, okay, so that is... Wait, do I have the mark a chest? Yep. So that's the optional chest for this area. Um... It's, I, I actually think it's really interesting also to think about this as like a Ubisoft product and then to think about like the way that Ubisoft in particular loves to repurpose mm -hmm. stuff and just kind of make very similar like combat systems and RPG mechanics and like they, uh, you know, like Assassin's Creed has changed a little bit, but like they don't, it's like they make these one, they make this one big change, right? Yeah. Uh, and then suddenly everything just is made with that same system in mind mm -hmm. for years and years and years. And I mean, like, I know that this game, that the nice. Immortals was a spinoff. It was basically taking the Assassin's Creed Odyssey engine mm -hmm. and saying, like, make a kind of, like, for all ages version. So even Immortals wasn't, like, a new direction. It was just simplifying the, um, the, the Odyssey engine and then... Um, ripping off Breath of the Wild at the same time. So, mm. oh, yeah. um, because, I mean, like, I think that Ubisoft has a problem where nowadays where it's like their shit's just too similar. And in some ways you can think about that as like a, as like a good thing, mm -hmm. right? So it's like, well, whatever your, whatever your pleasure is, uh, Ubisoft has got you covered with some variant on the Climb up the towers, you know. Yeah. Uh, Climb the towers. Here's look, some RPG mechanics, that kind of stuff. Um, but on the other hand, it makes all their games incredibly samey and bland. Right. Um, at least Immortals isn't realistic. At least Immortals has yeah. a fucking art style yeah, for the first time in like five years of video games. It's kind of fun. It's stylized. a little bit cartoony. Yeah. I mean, that was... It's funny. What was the last funny Ubisoft game? 
like Mario raving rabbits, like what yeah. that that game with uh, Rabbit Peach and her selfies. Like, oh my god, that was pretty funny. Yeah, uh, and then I'm thinking about. Um, okay. And now, now of course, I'm thinking about how like much offense I took to Yahtzee shitting all over Ghost of Tsushima because it vaguely resembled a Ubisoft open world game. It was so much better than any Ubisoft open world game I played. Well, that was like I said, he just he just was like he just shat over he just shat all over it. Is there like uh, some Uh, blocks that I can get? Possibly. Um, Ah, there you Uh, go. There's a block. And um, yeah, and oh, hello. World logs. Oh. Okay. Um. And I just remembered, like, listening. To, that was that was one of the that was one of the signals that I was like, okay, I think I'm, I think I'm a little bit done with old Yahtzee, old Benjamin Croshaw. Yeah, I haven't. Um, interesting. Um, I haven't appre- I haven't really liked Yahtzee very much in a long time because he seems to have a real mat on for indie games in a way that like if that's your if that's your preference, then I'm, you know, I'm not telling you what to like and what not to like. But on the other hand, it's like, okay, I don't have a power or something for this because mm. uh, there's something going on over there. Anyway, I'm sure that this is like end game. You got to get all the powers to be able to get through all these things. Lock. Find a way out. Oh, okay. Way. Or maybe I, maybe I do. Maybe I have to find this. Maybe this is like the puzzle to get out of here. Maybe, yeah. Uh, mm. But like uh, his just like general disdain, it seems like whenever he goes into... Um, anything that's not an indie game, he's just like looking for reasons. Like he's just well, looking for a reason to have a problem with well, it. Well, yeah, uh, it's cause it's his whole um, it's his whole shtick, and he he's obviously feels like he has to maintain his shtick now. I think I heard a gust oh. of wind. Oh, there you go. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this wind flows right out of the temple. Wee! Yay! Nice. Oh, this is fucking pretty. Um, yeah, and and I don't mind that. Like I've actually seen there's a lot of stuff online that talks about uh. Like reviewers that start out being like angry about broken stuff, mm-hmm. a lot of times will kind of get trapped in this thing where it's like, well, you don't want to watch. You don't want to watch the guys from Red Letter Media just go like, this movie was pretty good. I enjoyed it. Like Justice League. Uh, well, <laughs> uh, yeah. Who'd want to kill a dragon? Enormous skull of a dragon. Oh, that's nice. Cause they're. Cause oh look, yeah, over yeah. there. Well, and and I like that because he's like, who would want to kill a dragon? Because. Yeah, dragons in Asian and especially Chinese mythology are benevolent creatures. Peng Lai. Okay. I mean, that that is a thing that I think can't really be overstated is how... Oh, whoa. Oh, man. Okay. Um, that is one of the things that I think can't really be overstated, oh. in, especially in... Go to the Peace Forge and talk to Nua. Okay. And She's going to be mad that we left. Yes. Uh, in Chinese mythology is that, like, dragons are, like, so super sacred. Uh-huh. Like they're How not are you Oh. What? How am I hearing you? I fell out of the sky. How are we talking? The bracer on your arm. Oh. It's, it's like a invention of mine. We can chat from anywhere. It's like a and like the eventually there will be Oh. Uh, uh, I know you have many questions, but Ooh. Wait. Hmm. It's a goodie. Where are you? On my way to the forge. Um Surprise? Ooh, look at that guy. Child. Just, <laughs> Just kind of disappointed, like, ugh, really? Let's see. Is it? It's that up there, right? That's where I'm going. Uh, I think so. Okay, let's see what we can see. We can figure that out. Um, yeah. So I don't know. I for a, uh, there was a while back where I'm like, I I even tried to listen to like the the debate thing that Yahtzee does well. with the uh, Jack. Uh, what's his face? And I was like, eh, this is okay. But you know what, Matt? In general, these days, like, I- I've been playing video. I'm, like, my birthday was last week. Mm-hmm. I turned 43 years old. Yay. I've been playing games since I was three. Mm-hmm. I've been playing games for 40 years. I don't need to know somebody else's opinion. <laughs> I can make up my own fucking mind about, like, what games are good. And in the same way that, again, mentioning Red Letter Media, that Red Letter Media does not seem to like big action blockbuster movies all that much because mm-hmm. they're really hung up on like plotting and pacing and that stuff is important but sometimes you just want to watch it blow up um yeah uh, i uh okay jesus 
Ah, I see. More lasers. And I didn't know there were so many lasers. Chinese lasers. Yeah, China, China's got man on for lasers. All right. Um, um, yeah, I, I, I see what you're saying. Like, and kind of th- I just kind of wish that Yahtzee would... Uh, I really liked the last game that he made. Uh, I don't think I ever played... It was like a stealth, a 2D oh. stealth like art heist game, and I really liked it. And I wish that yeah. there were more games. Oh, that's a bear. Well, his, uh, I mean, his, yeah, um, right now, bear. again, his bread and butter is the escapist, and it is zero punctuation. Yeah. And I think he has a very creative mind and a very creative voice, and I really like, I like a lot of what he has done creatively. I just feel like, yeah, I feel like his, his shtick, for me, as somebody who's been watching him since he started uploading on, like, YouTube, yeah. Um, it got really old, mm-hmm. especially when he starts, like, leaning into kind of edgelord stuff, like um, calling uh, Kamala Khan in the Avengers a diversity hire. I'm like, oh, so fucking edgy. It's funny because... Welcome to 2007. It's funny because everybody who reads comics told me how much they like Kamala Khan. Yep. And I didn't really... Um, I don't read comics, so I was like, okay, but she's just, like, stretchy, and I don't really get it. And then I played the Avengers game, and I was like, oh, no, she's delightful, and she's a great character for, like, you know, introducing people to this thing because she's got kind of a nice POV character oh, who's also it? a fan. Mm-hmm. She, she's, like, you know, she's a good character where if you're a fan of the Avengers, yeah. then you'd be like, oh, I get what this girl is feeling because I also am a fan of the Avengers. Yeah. Like, if I saw Iron Man, I would freak out, too. I'd be like, oh, my God, Tony Stark! I mean, that scene with her and <laughs> Thor at the the beginning of the game is fucking adorable. Yeah, so like I, I that's that's cool. But yeah, you know, I and I just, I just, library. Oh. Yeah, and I guess that's all I'm saying is like, oh, this is the upgrade station, like the. Oh, this is like the thing with Hermes. Yeah, like the like the big place where the gods hmm. uh, hang out. Hang out. So can I do any of these? These hmm. are collect jade coins to upgrade godly powers. Okay, it looks like they might have streamlined the upgrades slightly. I can put put that in there, and then oh, maybe this one too. Yes, <laughs> please, thank you. I'm just I'm just thinking about. Uh, oh, there you go. I'm just thinking about. Um, I'm thinking about like the writing style of this game and how it's probably um, upgraded my cloth. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's probably uh, again sarcasm is probably not like in Japanese culture. Sarcasm is probably not um, a super big part of Chinese humor. I'm making an assumption, I, which makes an ass out of you and me, but um, I, I just wonder if the, if the, if the uh, writing style is more directly indicative of Chinese writing style as opposed to a Phoenix, a Phoenix, which was you know very sarcastic and very quippy. Yeah, um, I'll tell you what. I mean, one of the things that I really did enjoy about Phoenix was the um, was the fact that everyone had. Greek accents. <laughs> yeah, and I'm, I'm, I, I, I did like that too, and I'm noticing that a little bit in this game. Where this is pretty much the exact same animations for upgrading. Well, yeah, that. but they but they clearly, uh, you know, the characters we've met thus far have a slight like tinge to their voice. Yeah, you know? like, I really actually here we need to go talk to her because we're just about done, and I really want to see if we can get through because I'm sure that she's not the only person in the story. Yeah, I want to so, meet some other characters. Uh, let's see. She's going to tell us that she's all mad and stuff. She's like... I guess if she's the goddess that, like, t- made humanity from clay, then, like, having everybody get turned to stone, she's like, eh, hey, I'll turn him back on Friday. Uh, yeah, well, that's basically what she's <laughs> saying. I made it. What's next? I told you to What's stay put. What's next is you stay out of trouble, child. Goddess, please... I gotta kill the younglings. <laughs> Come on! Me. What I need is to patch up the skies. I like that she's a little bit stubborn. From overtaking us all. Well, it's just a blue sky laser. Those are all over the place. It's just Fortnite. It's just Fortnite over there. <laughs> There's just a Fortnite happening. Yeah. Yeah, destroy Fortnite for good. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Given form and structure led to the balance of heaven okay. above and earth. These are much better. With These are much, 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 much better. Cutscenes. Cutscenes, cut yes. Yeah. yeah I just really the fact that she has custom animations, like the fact that her, she put her finger out, because it used to be they were just standing there doing their idol animations. Uh, their the camera moves. 
Yeah, and this is like her eyes are darting in certain directions. Yep. She looks up. Yep. It's obvious that Phoenix Rising was was rushed mm -hmm. out the door. Mmm. Toss it into the scar. Jeff, what? I want. Oh, I, I kind of want fried rice now from that uh, Chinese place. Oh my road. god! <laughs> I'm just saying it's, it's too not, fucking easy, man. It's just, I'm not saying it's any <laughs> any direct connection. I'm just. She's started, like, we got to make a bowl of balance. Matt is like, I'm yes. super fucking hungry god right now. now. I want. I want hot dogs. Uh, I want hot. I want so many hot dogs. Just like a million hot, hot dogs. Do Maybe I could get like a hot dog from the one place and I could go get fried rice from the other place. <laughs> and then I can have the hot dogs and fried rice. Uh huh. Yeah. That, oh shit. I could have fried rice. I could chop up hot dogs and put it, in, put it in the fried rice. Put it in the fried rice. You could make fried rice with hot dog chunks instead of yeah. like any other Just meat. Just go, go buying the two. And, and then once you've made the fried rice with hot dog chunks, you could just make a big bowl of chili and then just mix the two of them together. <laughs> That sounds like something Morgan would do. <laughs> and then get like one of those soup bread bowls and put it all in there with a lot of cheese. And then film yourself and put it on one of those horrible internet channels that like teaches you how to make stupid food for dumb people. I suppose if you want to help, we can start small. Okay. I'm ready. Not been paying attention. Please tell me what I should do. Tell you? Child, no. It's time for you to learn through the most efficient educational process known to humankind. Oh, standardized testing. Oh, of course. Oh, oh I got to read. I got to read scrolls. Oh, uh, shit. <laughs> It's going to take me a year to get through one wall. Investigate the furnace and identify what's missing. Oh, my God. We do have to do fucking homework. Um, it seems God is new eyes searching for something from the sky. Like the of heaven Lightning? The pieces that fell in Peng Lai. It's really fascinating to think, Matt, about how like um, there's so many like universal things uh, in the uh, on the Earth, mm -hmm. and that like all of humanity made up entirely different horse shit. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Where it's like lightning, and then like different cultures were just like, oh, that's because I figured it out. That's because of this dumb made up reason, and then somebody else is like, no, no, it's because of this dumb made up You're reason. You're a fucking asshole. Or you know. Yeah. And everybody got mad at each other for not coming up with the same dumb made up reasons. Gong Gong. Oh. The Lord Gong Gong. Shit. Oh, Double man. G. I feel like we're on a cusp of meeting another character. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, this is probably the wrong way to do this, but I'm, I'm just taking a shortcut. I don't want to like. Don't mind me. Go up all that. Don't mind me, goddess. Ooh, here, Ooh, let me get another, get another scroll right. on monsters. Mm. Oh. Okay, you can take that away well, with the cutscene. What did your studies uncover? Well, <sighs> he looks the flames I, of Yandi and the pieces of the sky. We shall craft a magnificent flame sky thing and <laughs> the hell out of the <laughs> balance the hell out of it. Yeah, I take like that, it. the scar. I, no getting in trouble. No running off to mom. You keep your she really is kind of like everybody's mom. Well, I mean that's <laughs> literally what it is. She's like, oh god, it's humans. Yes, mom. Oh, there's a phoenix. I'll let you go off alone. Uh, yep, we got a phoenix. Yep, like phoenix had a phoenix, so we get a phoenix. This bird will go with you and keep you safe. It's beautiful. It's on fire. I don't think it's I should touch it. On fire. Uh, His name is Jingwei. All right. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> no, stop it. Jingwei is a beautiful name. I bet it's a joke. I bet it's like a like a. <laughs> it means like. Anyway. Fried chicken. I don't know. Yeah. It's a technique I've developed. When using it, your body will become as light as Ooh. Mm. This is how you do it. Air jumps. Oh, sweet. Okay. Cool. Nice. nice. So, I was thinking of going to the Jangwood Tree first. That's where the rain goes to the land. <laughs> I'm going to fight a bunch of guys. Don't tell mom. Locate the pieces of the heavenly kingdom and bring me back the flames of Yandi. Rainbows won't help. Oh, don't say that. Rainbows but are cool. Maybe that dead dragon could hold some clues. They this dude really wants to go see that dead dragon. Enough. 
There are no rainbows left in Palai. Not I think even their the lip sync is better. Yeah. That's impossible. Focus, child. <laughs> so upset. Mm. Pieces of heaven. Mom! Mom! Flames of I want to see a dragon! All right. Yep. Well, okay. They're letting us back out in the world. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Um, Please be careful. Hit the like, subscribe button. Come back tomorrow. We're going to play some more of this. Yeah. Um, and if you like it, if you like what you hear and you like what you're seeing and everything, go to patreon.com uh, forward slash rage select. Helps out. Kick us some bucks. Oh, I think this is uh, the legend himself. Gong Gong, oh. the warlord of the Yandi clan here at a mini. Shame about his weapon. Go to Buzhao and find the flames of Yandi. And then what do we got here? We've got uh, locate the fallen pieces heavens. of heaven. Okay. Let's go, let's go meet this guy. Um, gong Gong. Gong. Yeah. Uh, Patreon.com forward slash rage site helps out kick some bucks. You know how you know the deal. You know how it do. You know how you know how it is. Uh, YouTube has definitely stopped showing my videos to anybody who isn't already subscribed. So uh, like, hey, it's cool. You guys are all here. Um, yeah. So yeah, do that. Um, Matt, where can the people find you on the interwebs? You guys can find me over at. Uh, uh, mattfrankart.net and patreon.com slash mattfrankart. I am going to be at Pensacon in May mm. uh, along with um, Kaylee Huddle, the um, young actress from Godzilla vs. Kong. Oh, yeah. You were talking about that on the yeah. podcast last yeah. week. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's that I got going on. And uh, yeah. All right. And uh, yeah, join us back here tomorrow where we're going to uh, play more of uh, uh, Immortals Phoenix Rising DLC name I can't remember. Eastern something. Yeah. Yeah. Bye.